All right, everybody. Um, this is Sammy Joe. Sammy Joe, what's up, bud? Sammy Joe. And he is my little buddy. My uh, desktop buddy. Keeps me company. I love to watch him eat. And he does have a little friend in there with him. Uh, who will remain nameless because... Well, he's just there to keep S.J., Sammy Joe, company. So, I'll probably let him go because I believe he's a male and Sammy Joe is a male. And males don't get along, but he's so little, they, uh, they seem to be bonding. But anyways, um... I'm going to show you guys what they eat so far. I have been catching them. Moths. Moths. Grasshoppers. Crickets. I've got about 15 moths. Two grasshoppers. And a small cricket. Sorry. A small cricket. That I just went out and got. Very lethargic in the uh, morning sun, so they were pretty easy to catch. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. And uh, I have this stuff, which is uh, freeze dried crickets, and I have to crush them up because they're too big for these little guys. Um, it said that the food should be no bigger than the width of their eyes. And um, Michelle got this little guy for me. So I'd have some company while I'm working at my desk. And uh, they can't eat that grasshopper, he's too big. So, I'll probably get him out of there and set him free. And I got a couple of dead moths because, well, they're too big. Way too big. So, we got to pick them out of there and throw them away. Got some fresh water, stick, a couple of smooth rocks. They dig all that stuff. Some reptile bedding. They dig all that stuff. Um, all right. Let's feed them something. Yeah, don't get out now, Sammy. They're fast little buggers. Fast. Put some of these guys in there, like so. Like so. Get back a little bit. Oh, Sammy got something. Sammy got something. Good boy. Good boy, Sammy. Dang, what'd you get? Ooh, he got the he got the cricket. Look at him eat the cricket. Nummy cricket. Dang. Hungry bugger. Awesome. Good boy. And he does have a hurt foot. He had the hurt foot when Michelle found him. So, I don't know if he would have lived with the hurt foot or not. But, uh, it says they live about four years. And they do sell them at the pet store. But, you know, in southern, or no, northern Carolina, they are uh, quite prolific. Prolific? Prolific. Right. Where'd the moths go? That little guy needs a moth. Oh, there's a moth on the tree. Yep, I see a moth on the tree. But anyways, good boy, Sammy. Uh, I've been calling him uh, Speck, but that's not his name. I don't know. 
Uh, I guess I just thought maybe Sammy needed some company when I first got him, but he can't stay in there. I, and uh, I got to get a, an aquarium because this is way too small for Sammy. But we weren't sure that he'd even make it because of his little black foot over there. But I woke up one morning and he was sitting on my desk in this little cage. Thank you, Michelle. I love my little buddy. Um, they are called, just a minute, just a minute. A green anno. A green anno. Yep. And um, a lot of people down here call them chameleons because they turn brown. I do believe they turn brown when they are stressed. But I am not, I repeat, I am not an anole aficionado. So I could be wrong. And if I am, I stand corrected. Yes, I do. But anyways, you can have like one male and four females or something like that. I'm sorry I don't have the, the camera on the tripod. I'm just showing you guys some what I think is cool. Let's see if he's going to get that moth. Come on, he's right there. Get him. Get him. Get him. No? <laughs> hey, Sammy. Hey, buddy. Hey, bud. Sammy. Hey, Sam. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't get out of there, Sammy. Get back, buddy. Get back, baby. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this little video of little Sammy. Okay, I forgot to show you that they do have a little heat lamp also because they like heat. So they have a heat lamp. Thank you again, Michelle. And, um, oh, look at the little guy just got one. Just wanted you guys to see that he was eating. Um... There he is. He's eating something too. Good boy. I think he's a boy. Uh, said that the boys have red throats, and it looks like he's got a little red throat there. Um, it says typically that the males don't get along. Um, that they use head bobbing or something to show that they're upset, but they don't do that stuff. So uh, they seem to be chilling together. Hopefully that doesn't mean anything disturbing. But anyways. My little buddies. Thanks for watching guys. I'll show you an update when I get him in an aquarium in the next couple days. Um... I find this interesting. You guys might think it's boring as hell, but there's videos on YouTube of nothing but hair dryers for eight hours, so, you know, to each their own. Peace.